Okay, beautiful people, listen up. This is gonna be one of the motivational videos that you are going to love because I'm telling you from the bottom of my heart what happened yesterday, what happened today, and what, what will happen next. So, yesterday I went to meet some people that gave me amazing, amazing um, details needed for having my book printed. I couldn't have learned all those details if I didn't go to those meetings, if I didn't, you know, just uh, trying to learn about what I need to do next. Because I set the event on the 1st of December, but I had no clue what would be waiting for me to get there. But it's possible. So listen up. Um, after getting all these details, then um, I was kind of, you know, um, I was called to be a dreamer, to, to have this event done in such a short in such a short while. So I have three weeks in which I need to organize everything. I need to print my book, I need to find a location, I need to do all these things in such a short time. And every, as I said, people called me to be a dreamer, but I'm a big dreamer and I'm a stubborn dreamer. So what happened? Last evening I couldn't sleep because my kids, I don't know what, what went wrong with them, but they, they didn't let me sleep. In the morning I was, you know, I was trashed. I couldn't open my eyes. I could barely move. But after I left them to the kindergarten, um, I started, you know, just going to all these newspaper uh, small shops and asking for people for advice and for directions and if they know any kind of small publishing house that would take my uh, my book with a low amount of you know uh, prints like 50 to 100 or something like that and they all looked at me like oh my god you're just dreaming girl you're never gonna get that and something like that and um, after, you know, going from a small newspaper shop to another, I finally found, you know, uh, a print center and I asked for, I asked for an advice, I asked for a price offer and um, then when I got home, I was so, so tired that I just crashed. I literally crashed and I had to sleep for, I guess, four hours or something like that. And when I woke up, I just found the the price offer for the, from the printing center, and I was like, "Oh my God, that that cannot be because it's a huge amount, huge amount. I would never have all that money to you know just pay for that." And um, then I just you know starting researching, uh, talking to people here and there, uh, making phone calls, sending emails, and to my surprise, at some point I found a man who is also a, um, a poet. So he's a poet for God's sake. And he had such a smooth voice, you know, like the voice of a very, very good priest that is, you know, talking to you with his open heart. And we had this really open conversation. And he said, you know what? I'm gonna help you with also putting, um, you know, formatting the book as you want so that the pages look well, so that everything goes well, and I'm gonna print it. I can even print three books for you if you want with no additional cost. And he gave me less than one fifth of uh, of the price that I have that ha that I received from from the printing center. So today I just want to share with you the fact that no matter how many um, how many obstacles you face, no matter of the, the adversities that you go through. If you set your mind to do something, if you work on it big time and you, you know, believe in it, you need to believe in it. You need to believe that it's possible, first of all. So if you do that, if you believe with all your heart that what you want is going to happen, it will, I promise. So I'm, you know, doing this while taking care of two kids, while I have no income, and I'm doing it. So in less, I don't know, by the end of next week, I'm gonna hold my book in my hand. So it's like, 
the greatest accomplishment ever and I just felt the need to to share with you all the joy that I feel right now and you know this encouragement that whatever you put your mind at your whatever you dream is possible regardless of what regardless of what other people tell you if you have a small group of people behind you that believe in you and that encourage you on you know uh, constantly and if you if you believe in yourself and definitely put your mind to it nothing is impossible everything is possible trust me see you